It was a cloudy and overcast morning at UK's Research and Education Center, which made for comfortable temperatures. Not usually the case for July in western Kentucky, but welcomed by the crop scouting teams. The eight high school teams, consisting of four to six members, rotated through ten stations in the competition, ranging from soil properties to a morning glory. Can anybody tell me what kind of morning glory? To weeds, corn agronomics, and more in a very hands-on event. Basically, our, our students are coming here, they're doing the hands-on activities with some of our pests, so insects, diseases, weeds. We're teaching them how to scout fields, um, work with some of our soil issues, and also some basic corn soybean agronomics as well. Because they're at a younger growth stage, do you think that... Kirsten Wise said the competition is very similar to what a professional crop scout or consultant would do in their job and gives UK a chance to showcase its facilities. We think this is a great opportunity for the University of Kentucky to interact with um, high school students, um, particularly students that are interested in agriculture. Uh, of course, I did some scouting when I was back in, in high school and college. Bobby so, uh, Schmidt, who has side. taught agriculture at Livingston County for 25 years, was excited about the opportunity to bring his students to the competition and be so close to home. I've been over here several times for field days and stuff, and uh, if nobody's ever been here, it, it's really a, a neat place because you see so much uh, on, on relatively a, a small acreage. And I think it's a good, uh, good representation of West Kentucky, of the soils that we have, uh, and a lot of the growing conditions. You mentioned some of the insects. Schmidt liked the fact the contest involved UK really specialists that guiding the students um, through the stations. The UK faculty, graduate students, and interns all were involved in the competition, and the students in the contest said they learned a lot. Like in the field, going and like staging corn and like which stage it comes in, and like I learned the same with like soybeans. Um, I got to learn like where you look at at the plant, like which node you need to look at and different stuff like that. So that was pretty cool. I believe it will give me foresight for the future to kind of see what I'd be getting into, like taking like college courses and, oh, hey, you know, this is kind of what this is about, you know, give me just a little bit of information before you dive deep into that big terminology. Officials at UK's Research and Education Center Hope to make the competition an annual event. From the University of Kentucky College of Agriculture, Food and Environment, I'm Jeff Franklin reporting.